Hello, hello, hello. Wow, that was a bad intro. Yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and contemplate my intro a little. Anyways, besides the point. So, uh, just a quick thing about this painting. I wanted to try some masking fluid, so I put it in a smaller bottle to make it easier to apply, and then I used a palette knife, and it didn't work for me. So, I ended up ruining one of my paintbrushes. Joy! But I really do like the small little bottle that I have it in because it was so easy to apply from that. That was so nice. Anyways, <clears throat> this is a quick painting for a co-worker who had ended up leaving the company I was working for. Um, and, you know, she was a really great co-worker, so I wanted to kind of paint her a little gift. Anyways, so I have been... Uh, I've kind of not uploaded in a while and honestly it's mainly because I'm not really sure where I want to take my channel and I keep having debates about it I keep trying to figure it out for myself and it's been a struggle thinking about what I want to do because I have too many hobbies like I legit like if you see a lot of what I do I there's too many styles too many hobbies nothing consistent and I feel like I really want to build up my channel and make it more consistent so uh, I've kind of decided you know after this painting I'm going to well actually since this is watercolor it wouldn't really matter anyways because I was gonna say I'm gonna focus more on marker art and painting uh, with watercolor I still love doing acrylics and I'm gonna do more acrylic paintings on the side and I think once a month upload like um, either an acrylic painting or an oil painting or some other project because I'm a really creative person and I can't not do other artsy stuff like for right now I've gotten into doll customizing and I don't know how that's going because I'm trying it and I don't know how to sew so this is gonna be a problem with me trying to sew an outfit for this doll but that's kind of what I mean when I say I have too many interests and I like too many things to not want to do it all, but at the same time, I feel like because I do so much, it ends up impacting, I guess, where I stand in social media and where I stand on YouTube. Granted, I, I mean, I don't really have followers right now. I have like six, I think, if that, but I want to build up my channel and Maybe somebody who's watching this will be like, yeah, you're not consistent at all, and this is why we don't care to watch your channel, and that would totally make sense to me. So I'm going to try to keep it more consistent, more just focusing on marker, focusing on watercolor, because to me those two are the easiest things to kind of use when I'm trying to do a painting or do something quick, right? I might do some color pencil work. Um, but it just depends on what the topic is. And I think I do want to focus more of my art style on more of a fantasy kind of feel. I do love doing realism, or semi-realism, because I can't do... Well, I guess I can't do hyper-realism. I can do some realism, right? But I want to focus more on kind of fantasy, kind of more... I guess in a way like an illustrative style that's what I enjoy the most when I'm doing art granted every once in a while I might venture off you know just depends on my mood that day or what I kind of see but I want to do quick and easy videos in the sense of something that isn't gonna take me days and days like I'm actually recording an oil painting right now and oh my gosh like, it takes me forever to do an oil painting. Like, I know some people just, like, zoom on it through it and it takes them a couple days. And I'm like, ooh, it's been, like, four months, Anna. What are you doing wrong? Anyways. So, I think I really want to focus on more illustrative art. Just something simple. Something nice. You know? Something that's more relaxing. Um, don't really know where that will take my channel or how much I'll actually continue with that. But I'm hoping that by keeping it more consistent, I can really start building myself up a little bit more. Um, and I probably should use all of my marker collections, considering how I have way too many. Not as much as 
most people I think but I mean I have my Copics I have the Uhu markers I have the touch 5 from wish.com which I haven't even tried yet I have the dot markers because those were going out and I know they're basically Winsor Newton which I also have oh my gosh yeah I have way too many markers not to be using them because I tend not to bring out my markers because I'm always in that kind of mood of I feel like I should be painting or I should be doing other things but I feel like if I make my channel more consistent I'll use the supplies I actually love using which is color pencils and markers right um anyways I really hope you guys kind of like the speed painting it was actually a really fun painting to do like I said I'm gonna focus more on watercolor I keep telling myself like I want to improve on it because I really love the way watercolor looks right so I'm hoping to start improving more on it start really learning how to do it more and at the same time improving just my art style in general my, just my art in general I don't really think I'll ever have a, a style so to speak right it's gonna be Anna's style is my whims and fancies right but I can at least improve my skills that's kind of what my aim was when I first started YouTube so let's kind of go back into that like I don't know I I feel like I keep beating myself up or putting myself down because I don't really know what I want to do right and it, it's kind of hard when you feel so directionless either way I I don't know Anyways, I am hoping that who's ever feeling discouraged, just know that no matter what you do, as long as you love what you do, that's what is important. Alright, please take care, and I hope everyone has a great rest of the day, or night, or whenever you're watching this. I don't, it might be 3 in the morning. Anyways, take care.